students, it's Shayna, your teacher from EspressoEnglish.net, and the phrasal verb of the day is look up to. I'll teach you this phrasal verb in just a moment, but first I wanted to say that I'm so happy to see more students signing up for my phrasal verbs in conversation course. It's a great course and I think you'll really like it. So if you'd like more information, then click on the link in this video or in the description and you can get more information about phrasal verbs in conversation or sign up today. All right, let's learn about look up to. I have three possible definitions on the board and only one of them is correct. As I describe the situation, I want you to post a comment and tell me whether you think look up to means A, admire someone, B, ask someone for help, or C, learn more about someone. All right? Here's an example. Let's say you're talking with your coworker about uh, your families and you say, I really look up to my brother because my brother is very ambitious and very successful, but he's also very generous and he really cares about people. So I look up to him. And your coworker says, oh, that's so nice. I had a boss who was like your brother. She was very, very successful and very important in the company, but she always took the time to mentor me and give me advice. So I really looked up to her as well. Based on this situation, what do you think it means to look up to someone? A, B, or C? Post your answer in the comments and in just a moment, I'll tell you which one is correct. Look up to someone means a, to admire someone. So I gave the example of my brother who's very ambitious and successful, but he's also very generous and he cares about people. Those are all good qualities and so I admire and I respect him. And then my coworker gave the example of uh, her first boss who was also very important in the company, but took time to help out someone who was more junior in the company. And so my coworker also looked up to her boss. She admired her boss and uh, wanted, even wanted to be like her. So we use look up to for people who we really admire and respect, and we usually want to be like this person in their positive qualities. One quick note, don't get look up to someone confused with a similar phrasal verb, which is look up some information or a fact. So we use look up information or a fact to refer to looking for and checking a fact in some sort of reference. So if you don't know a word, you would look up the word in the dictionary. Or maybe you want to find the phone number for a hotel and so you look up the phone number uh, on the internet. So look up a fact or information means to check that fact and see if it's true or confirm it or find out more about that fact. But look up to someone means to admire and respect someone. All right, let's see if you can use this phrasal verb in your own English post another comment and try to use it yourself. Tell me about someone who you look up to, either now or maybe when you were a child. I'd love to read your comments. I'd also love to see you inside my Phrasal Verbs in Conversation course. So again, click on the link to learn more about that. Thank you for watching today and I'll see you in the next lesson. Bye-bye.